Hi, it's Sue Derby at Shore West Realtors with this week's Tuesday's Two Cents Worth. Sherwin-Williams announced their color of the year for 2023, and what a surprise it was for me. The color is called Reed and Point, which really gives you no clue as to what the color actually is. It's a warm, soft, tannish colors, and the companion colors for it are also rust, tans, and ivory. Pretty much the same colors that I did my kitchen in, and oh, I think it was 1980. Anyway, it appears that we're heading away from those cool gray tones and are moving towards the warmer colors, almost reminiscent of the 70s. We're also seeing a lot of mustard, which is a variation of the harvest gold of the past, and also the olive greens, which we called avocado green back then. I even noticed these colors in the towel section at Target. Decorators say that these earthy hues help ground us by creating a feeling of comfort, familiarity, and approachability. The colors of nature are very soothing. That being said, Pantone announced that, or Pantone rather, announced their color of the year, and it's a very vibrant magenta. I also noticed a lot of blues in the furniture sections of area stores. Pops of color like that might be just what you need to brighten up the gray you have now. A pillow or a throw or a picture on the wall can bring these colors in without doing a big redecorating job. So whether you're freshening up your home to stay a while or sell, Travis and I have many resources that can help you. Painters, decorators, remodelers, we're always happy to connect them with you. Thanks for tuning in to this week's Tuesday's Two Cents Worth. This is Sue Derby at Shaw West Realtors, your local realtor ready to work hard for you. If you find this information helpful or interesting, please share it with your friends and family. We'd love to be able to help them too.